Hey guys, Lacey here. It's that time again. Yes, the weekend is here and it is time for the drink of the week. Today, we were making something almost Christmassy, but not really Christmassy. It is a peppermint martini. Yes, peppermint martini. And so, with that being said, let's get this party started. Party likes 1999, I say. Um, so this has some fun stuff to it. You, you can mix it up and make it a little more Christmassy if you want. I'm not really going to do it this time. Um, it's really a peppermint bark martini, but I don't have any peppermint bark. So we're just going to go with a peppermint martini. It sounds so good. I'm like so excited. So it includes vodka. One of my favorites. Again, my big old monster bottle of vodka. <laughs> Boom. I love that sound. So we have two ounces of vodka. Uh, again, I'm not a, really a measure. I'm more of a pour. Two ounces of vodka. Party hearty. Um, two ounces, and this is the delicious part, white chocolate liqueur. I had to go out and find this. I didn't even made this stuff. Mmm, that smells good. So it's two ounces of chocolate liqueur. Looks about right. <laughs> And a half ounce of peppermint schnapps. Funny thing. <laughs> peppermint schnapps. I would not normally buy a gigantic bottle of peppermint schnapps like this, but I could not beat the price. And it was crazy. I went to the liquor store and I was like, okay, I need to get a small bottle of peppermint schnapps. A bottle this big was going to cost me the same amount of money as this bottle. It's going to cost me 10 bucks. 10 bucks, I say for a bottle this big. So it was like, this bottle was $6.99. I'm like, why would I buy something so small when I can buy something so gigantic? Do you think I have a problem with gigantic stuff? Maybe that's why I married Mr. Lacey. I'm just saying. Okay, so we have peppermint schnapps, um, i.e. the peppermint martini. <laughs> and this calls for a half an ounce, because I guess, you know, they don't want to overload your senses with peppermint. So. Looks about right. And then with all of that in here, you pour that in here. Hopefully we won't get it stuck this time. Give it a good shake. Yay! I didn't get it stuck. I'm so excited. Strain that bad boy into a martini glass, for which I happen to have. Now, if you wanted to do it for the actual peppermint bark martini, they say take some white chocolate, melt it, cover the rim in the white chocolate, melt it, dip it in some crushed candy cane, and boom, you have a peppermint bark martini. And if you want this recipe, shoot me a shout out, and I will be happy to send you this recipe. It's pretty easy. It is two ounces of vodka, two ounces of chocolate liqueur, half ounce of peppermint schnapps, shake it in a martini shaker, pour it in your glass, and sip. That is good. That is a party. Ready to go. All right, guys, the weekend's here. I've got my drink of the week, and I'm gonna go party like it's 1999. You guys have a great day. Remember, hit that like and subscribe button for me. If you liked it so much, send it to a friend. I like friends. And if there's something out there you want me to try, mix tell you if it's good or not hit me up let me know i'll do it you guys have a great weekend have a great whatever cheers i'll see you next time bye